Good morning, everybody. Welcome to another vlog. It is Sunday morning, early in the morning, and I'm heading to the house. What time is it right now? It is... Up. I am up early in the morning, doing the old early to bed. Well, not early to bed, because I slept late. But early, early to rise. And what's the other one they say? The early bird catches the worm, that that thing. Well, that's what I'm doing. I am headed back to the house to drop off more stuff here. All the stuff I loaded last night. I'm learning right now, the last two days, is managing my time because there's still so much stuff, like, like I said in yesterday's vlog, that I have to do. The time is of the essence. Little, little at a time, you have to do it. Even if it means getting up early in the morning to drop off more stuff for the house. Because in the long run, it's going to help out. Now, what I don't want to happen is that we get lazy and complacent. And then Wednesday night, we're stuck with a bunch of stuff. What I want is by Wednesday, pretty much everything that we can deliver ourselves will be gone. So that Thursday, when the movers come, they, they're only here to move the big stuff. It's going to be a challenging rest of the week for the fact that I have to go to work this week and I got to still got to move, move much stuff to the old house, to the new house. So it's going to be about time. It's going to be about managing your time. I mean, last night I was talking to my wife and uh, she was kind of a little, little stressing out about the whole move and I had assured her, you know, you got to calm down, you know, learn how to manage your time and think of the end game. Think of what's happening that we are going to this new house, that don't feel overwhelmed about the situation. Just do one little thing at a time. That's why I'm loving what I'm doing. Even though it's Sunday and we're like five days from the move, you know, I'm doing something, you know, little. I'm moving, moving a couple, couple things, you know, because it all adds up. The little things all adds up and I'm just trying to assure her, assure her that that's the way it is. And she, kind of, she felt better after I talked to her because after we were done talking, she packed some stuff for me to to uh, send to the new house. Now, if she didn't do that, she would have to do it all herself today with me at work, and she would put added undue stress on herself and feeling overwhelmed about this whole situation. This is something that she needs to avoid, is don't feel overwhelmed and don't feel you have to do everything in one day. And I think she got it after uh, our little talk, but we'll see. I just arrived at the new house. There's not a soul like walking around anywhere in our neighborhood. It's just so peaceful and quiet. I love it. I absolutely freaking love it. All right, before I go back home, I just want to come out here on my new patio and just enjoy. I'm gonna tell you guys right now, I really like this part of the house. I'm probably gonna spend a lot of time out here relaxing, especially like after work. I wanna need some chill time. I'm gonna come out here, put up like a uh, bench or something, a chair, a lounge chair or something, and I'm just gonna relax. Wish I would've got a view of the strip over there somewhere. Unfortunately, I don't, but this is really cool. Really, really cool. So. Yeah, let me head back to the old house. Well, I wish I didn't have to, but I am headed to work now. I'd rather be home, continuing to move stuff to the new house, but gotta make that money to pay for the house. But first, I'm gonna head out to the Goodwill donations and donate all this stuff back here. I don't know if you can see it. Oh, it's like a three bags of clothing and this 
speaker system that I never used. Four bags of stuff, all donated. Funny, it is 10.13 as I'm driving to work. And I did a lot. I accomplished a lot in the three hours since I've been awake. Pretty proud of myself. Like I said, it's all about maximizing my time. Getting things done. But all right guys. Oh, let's go to work. Oh, so I'm right at work and I am tired. I actually got me a monster energy drink. You know. To get me through the day. Oh, I'm here. I'm here. So that was fun. Being at work for seven hours and being tired pretty much the whole day. It was funny because when I got to work, one of my coworkers noticed that I was kind of like glassy eyed and like really tired and and she noticed it right away and I was like, I felt it because like like the first two hours it took me a while to get into the rhythm of it because I don't know, I was just so tired and worn out from the weekend. It got a little better as the day went on. You know, I picked my energy picked up. Like right now, I feel fine. But I'm sure when I get home, I'm gonna feel worn out again. Oh, I just feel like right now, I'm gonna crash sometime. I feel like, I'm, I don't know why, I just feel like I'm gonna crash at any moment. But, you know, it's 7.20 right now. And I got some things I wanna do before I go to, before I go to bed. You know, I have to, um, and get some dinner because I think my wife wants Chinese food and then I got a offer on eBay so I gotta see about that and then I gotta watch the WWE Elimination Chamber is on so I have to go take care of all that tonight before I go to bed but I'm gonna do something something related to the move either packing or moving or something or some throwing something away something related to the move oh boy I love it though I love it love it love it I love it this is where we're getting dinner from. This is a very, very good Chinese fast food place. Very, very good. Nothing, a, nothing like a little Chinese takeout for the night. I'm trying to go. This is like hot and sour soup. This is like really, really good. What you do is you put it in a bowl and you get put these uh, put these cracker things. It's your summer awards. Oh, here's right, right here. There's so freaking good. Ooh, look at that. Oh, I'm gonna tear it up now. Man, that looks good right there. That looks really freaking good right there. Oh yeah. Woo, that Chinese food was good. Oh my God, it was so good. Anyways, I am up in my loft, chilling out, watching a little Elimination Chamber on the WWE Network. In the vlog, and then when I'm done and this vlog is uploading, I am going to load, probably do another load stuff over there. Load something, one of those things to the car so I can take it tomorrow when I go to the new house. So I'm going to end the vlog right here. So if you like this video, comment, like, and subscribe. Please share with your friends. And I'll talk to you tomorrow. Thanks for watching. And thanks for listening to me.